temperatures are in the 30s over much of the area, especially western counties, a little milder in the mountains than it is in the foothills. Martinsville, of course, one of the cooler spots it often is. Uh, currently checking in with 33 degrees, 37 in Danville, mid 40s in the tribe. We haven't quite cooled as much in some of the urban centers, uh, but temperatures are likely still going to fall here for the next couple of hours. Another drop in temperature from yesterday, which was about 10 to 20 degrees cooler than the day before. So uh, over the last 48 hours, temperatures are down some 15 to 30 degrees. So yes, it's uh, uh, convinced the kids necessary to wear a jacket to school today. Uh, we have frost advisories really for the northern half of the area, all of our Virginia counties, all the counties that uh, straddle the Virginia line, as well as the foothills and some of the North Carolina mountains. That's in effect until nine o'clock this morning. So we go from there and our first focus is farther west. We have a developing storm system in the Plain States. It's already starting to put them some rain down over Oklahoma and some snowy weather uh, parts of northern Kansas uh, just on the uh, the lee side of the Rockies. Farther to the south, we have this uh, call it a tropical wave. Uh, this development, I mean, could even briefly get a nominal name as it begins to move northward, but uh, more than likely this is going to kind of get stretched out along the front. <coughs> that's moving uh, through the southern plains and it will inject some tropical moisture into the system. So as we go through time, you'll see that moving inland. Uh, here we are four o'clock in the afternoon. I think initially, at least for the triad, this is too far west to be impactful. And I'm very hopeful that if it stays like this, that the first part of Saturday uh, is fairly dry. A lot of events going on on Saturday. The last thing we need is rain coming in, but it will be a pretty cloudy day. Uh, rain most likely coming in later Saturday, late afternoon, evening overnight that should linger into Sunday and then we have these little waves of energy coming along that stalled out front. It's going to keep some rain in the forecast into the early part of next week. So in the meantime, today is a sunny day. It will be cloudy tomorrow or at least mostly cloudy. So uh, savor days like today. Great afternoon to hit the park. Uh, temperatures will be in the 60s, high close to 70. Just a light breeze mainly out of the south at about five miles per hour at its peak. 68 in the foothills today. Another nice day uh, in places like Dobson and Jonesville later on this afternoon and across the mountain communities temperatures also getting into the lower 60s uh, south winds at about 5 to 10 miles per hour but heavier clouds move in tomorrow I do have a p.m. rain chance I think it's mostly west if we see it at all probably will end up dropping that overall just a small rain chance during the day on Saturday it will be greater in the mountains and western foothills for Saturday our wettest day this weekend will likely be on Sunday temperatures a little all over the place with a series of fronts passing through and changing our temperature profile, but it will start to warm up again uh, early next week before cooling down around midweek.